this time we're focusing on one of the most recognized names in East Tennessee. We're talking about Dr. Bill Bass, forensic anthropologist and founder of the Body Farm. Dr. Bass and his wife Carol have been married for over two decades now, but they actually met as children in Virginia. Dr. Bass spent two weeks a year playing with Carol on her family's farm. Here's more to their love story. Mine's a little bit different. I have lost two wives to cancer. I didn't like to be alone and knowing Carol all these years, I thought it might be good instead of spending two weeks a year with her, maybe she'd spend 52 weeks a year with her. So it worked out. It did. Well, He's always affectionate, always, and kind and considerate. Very, very, always funny. And uh, it, it, was, it was not hard to be with him. Every day with him is an adventure, <laughs> every day. He has two trunks of uh, bones in our garage, and uh, many, many times the doorbell rings, there's a deputy sheriff there with a paper bag, he's got a bone in it, he wants Bill to identify. And they love to go in my breakfast room and put the bones on my linen tablecloth <laughs> and move them around and uh, what have you. So yes, yes, my, my life is full of bones. If I'm away, I look forward to getting home. I don't think we ever, No. we've never had a never. fight or anything like that. I mean, that uh, she may not like some of the things I do, like putting bones on her tablecloth or something like that, but uh, you know, I can sit there years later and look at it and say, see that smudge? That's from this case. And, that smudge is from another case, you see. Mm. So. <laughs> he means a lot to me. He is uh, always jolly, always fun, and as you know, very smart, so he's always interesting to talk to. And every day with Bill Bass is an adventure. <laughs> Oh, I know it is. We love Dr. Bass. And you know, he has many speaking engagements throughout the year. And Carol will often travel with him. One of the ways she passes the time is knitting. Well, that turned out to give her a very funny story. It happened in Nashville. Here's Carol with more. One time he was giving a talk in Nashville and I was sitting on the back row knitting and two of the women in the room, it, did, didn't like it. They scowled at me. She said, how dare you knit while Dr. Bass talks? And I don't know why I did it, but I looked up and said, I sleep with Dr. Bass. I'll do anything I want while he talks. <laughs> <laughs> so knitting gets me in trouble sometimes. <laughs> She says Dr. Bass is funny. She has a great sense of humor, and uh, we love both of them, Dr. Bass and Carol. Thank you for sharing your love stories, and we wish you both a very blessed Valentine's Day. Bye.